What's going on, y'all? It's your girl, T. Nicole, coming to you live and direct from my desk with my boyfriend exercise equipment in the background. A, because it's real life. A, A. But no, um, <laughs> anyway, what's up, y'all? It's me. You know what it is. I'm coming to you today with a quick video. I always say it's going to be a quick video, but then it don't ever be that quick. But this video is going to be quick, bitch. Um, I just wanted to come to you today to encourage you to continue on this journey toward becoming a bitch. And if we here, like I know we here, you know what my definition of bitch is. And if you're watching this video for the first time, go ahead and watch the How To Be A Bitch playlist so that you understand what my definition of bitch means too. But I just wanted to encourage you today, you watching this, to keep on on this journey towards becoming a bitch. Keep on on this journey towards becoming your most powerful self. Keep on on this journey towards becoming your super shero or superhero self. You know what I mean? Um, once you start to step into your power, your relationship dynamics are gonna change. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you. This is not gonna be an easy journey, but it's gonna be, and it is a fulfilling journey because you deserve to live your happiest life. You deserve to live your most fulfilled life. You deserve to live a joyous life, a strong life, a confident life. You deserve all of that, you know? Um, so keep on, keep on, keep on. Um, it gets challenging, but you know, I'm right here for your ass and with your ass. This whole community, we're all right here with you and for you, you know? And um, I just wanted to encourage you to just keep going. It might get hard. Your boss might start tripping because you're stepping into your power, you know? Your um, friends might start tripping because you're stepping into your power. Your boyfriend, girlfriend, your partner, might start tripping because you're stepping into your power and you stepping into your power doesn't mean cussing everybody else out and doing all that bullshit, you know? That's the world's definition of bitch. That's not our definition of bitch, you know? But once you start to step into your power, become more confident, become more strong, more vocal about what your needs are, once you start creating healthy boundaries for yourself at school and at work and in your relationships, that might start to make other people feel uncomfortable. And um, once you start becoming more confident, that is going to make a lot of people feel uncomfortable because they are going to realize your power and your confidence and your strength and your joy. And they're going to be like, damn, either they're going to be like, wow, he or she is fucking amazing. Whoa, what do they have? And how can I be like that? Or either they're going to be like, whoa. This bitch, huh. she thinks she all that? He think he all that? Mm. You know, I mean, it's either gonna be one of the two. Either it's gonna be like an admiration cause you just gonna start glowing and shit. I'm telling you, you just gonna start glowing. Or it's gonna be jealousy, which I still believe is admiration, but they just don't, they haven't elevated spiritually to the point where they realize that they do admire you. So it turns in, it manifests itself in jealousy because it's like a low level vibration, but it's admiration. That's really what it is. And um, that that's going to start to make you feel, you're going to start noticing this because if you're on this journey, you are an aware person. You're going to start to notice other people's reactions to you. But I just want to encourage you to keep going. Because guess what? Their reactions don't matter. Their reactions don't pay your bills. Their reactions don't, um, they don't do nothing for you. So just ignore it if you can. If it ever gets to you, just let it roll off and say, you know, damn, that makes me feel a little bit uncomfortable. But guess what it is? It really is that they're realizing how amazing I am. And I'm just going to keep going. I'm just going to keep going on this journey because I'm great. And I deserve all the greatness that is on this planet for me. Feel me? Yeah. So that's all I wanted to say to you today. 
I love you and I thank you and I appreciate you so much for being on this journey with me. And um, yeah, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to this channel. If this video encourage you, make sure you really subscribe to this channel. And if this video encourage you, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Okay, so I wanted to let you know that I'm gonna be offering one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions via Skype. Yes, that's right. You can get the opportunity to talk to me for a whole hour and we'll talk about whatever it is that you need, you know? Whatever, I can help you to get to wherever it is that you want to be or I can help you to get through whatever situation you're currently going through. I can give you tools and tips to help you do that. You know what I mean? So if you want to set up that, that uh, Skype situation, <laughs> that Skype one-on-one -on -one coaching session with me, make sure to look down below in the description box for my email address. Email me, you know? And if you just have topics that you want me to do videos about, then leave me a comment down below and let me know. But if, like I said, if you want that in-depth conversation specifically tailored to your situation, then you need to go ahead and send me an email. I'm going to be offering four people the opportunity to have those one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions with me throughout the month of April. So yeah, go ahead and email me right now so we can get you scheduled and so we can do that thing. You know what I mean? Because this is all about helping you, helping us, helping the world to grow and be a better place. You know, because if we we are all our bitchiest best selves, the world is gonna be way more fun. So that's what we're here for. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay. Um. Yeah. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Whether it be via email, whether it be a comment down below, I look forward to it. And I will talk to you in the next one. Peace. That shit is bullshit. You don't have to be anything other than whatever you are right now.